Hi guys, I'm back again. So today it's gonna be an um, exciting episode. Because we're gonna upgrade my old computer. This is from Acer. Um, Aspire. And it was released on 2008. And it's 13 years old. So, um, first today we're gonna upgrade the RAM, and I just got this today, and by the way this laptop was given to me by someone, and I very appreciate it, because I didn't have a laptop that time, so I want to, um, you know, Keep things. I don't like to throw things that can be fixed. So let's um, talk about a little bit um, about the laptop. So this laptop have a crystal eye camera and superior HD image quality, 720p camera, and yeah, this is from. Acer and this is the the model name and I put some stickers behind it you know just to make it uh, this one I put it there and what I like this laptop because there's buttons you know like this if you want to turn your blue it's like you're in a cockpit of an airplane and uh, like this satellite dish means your Wi-Fi or internet and this I haven't checked it out but I'm not sure what is that for and here is what I like the most it has three um, different headphone jack for the microphone and the headphones and it have a volume ring and it includes a memory card reader not the card but in here built into the laptop and in this side is the DVD, you can put CDs inside. You play um, movies, and it have three USB um, plugs in this side and this side and this side. Yeah, and here's the power cord and the only thing is this computer doesn't have is um, HDMI but it has um, VGA here and the design is really good yeah so this is the back by the way it have lights if you notice I just put some stickers to make it look a bit cool and yeah let's um, talk about the RAM this is the part one we're gonna upgrade the RAM first so this laptop have a uh, three gigabytes of RAM but it's very old so I have two of this new RAM and this is 2 gigabyte and 2 gigabyte. So um, this RAM is from Crucial uh, DDR2, 2 gigabytes and 200 pin. So it's the same with the other one. And let's put it in. Okay, 
But first guys, um, before you're gonna upgrade your laptop, it's very important that you have to um, remove all power source in the computer. So when you put in the, um, for example, the RAM and the SSD or hardest hard drive of your computer, um, it will not damage your new um, your new hardware because last time I did it I didn't um, remove the battery and I change I removed this my RAM and my um, hard drive it didn't turn on so. So it's very important that you must remove all power source like this, the power cord and the battery. So let's remove the battery. So I'll check. We don't have uh, power anymore from the power cord and the battery. So it's safe to remove them or the hard drive so what I also like about this computer because um, what also I like about this computer is very very easy to maintain but I break some screws you know because it's very old and this is the most interesting part because you can just remove your hard drive and you know exchange it with the uh, um new SSD but we're gonna make a video about that later first we're gonna remove the RAM and change it to the new one so, yeah okay all you need is a little screw but careful um putting putting it in because you might damage the components down there uh, let's put it aside first okay sorry about that i haven't to uh, record the first one because i need my two hands but i have uh, ejected the first one so the second one it's hard to take a video well doing the work now it pops so careful removing it slowly okay so we're gonna need the first new one and we're gonna insert it but I'm gonna need my two hands again okay um, I have inserted the second one but I haven't pushed it yet Make sure when you push the um, RAM, um, be delicate of it because it might break like this. Yep. Now it's in. And the second one. So we need to find uh, the cut. I mean this cut from here. Um, I think it's that way. I think it's that way. I'm not sure. Okay, let me double check. Yeah, so it's the right way. Now I have inserted it in. So let's put it back in the battery. Make sure everything is close. Yes, the hard drive is close. And we're gonna put back the battery okay okay guys um now this is my old um ram from hynix it's two gigabyte of ram and the other one is from samsung and one gig so it's two to so it's total 3 gigabytes of RAM. That's the old one, so that's um, 13 year old. 
RAM. And now let's turn my laptop on. Let's see its, its performance. I can see it's a little bit faster now. Man, it's a bit faster, not like before. Because before it's like, um, it took three minutes to come here. Yep, I'm gonna type my password. Okay. So, my old RAM, I'm gonna put it beside here to my pocket from the new pocket okay Done. oh I can see it's so fast and by the way thanks for watching and for the next um, video I'm gonna make a video about the SSD because this is HDD um, but this one is solid state drive I'm gonna make video of this next so I can see the performance of the computer it improves a lot with the 4 gigabytes of RAM inside and uh, what if there's um, SSD. I think it will triple or quadruple the speed of the computer. So let's check. Let's play some movies. For example, a good movie. And by the way, about the old RAM, you can keep it. Maybe you have a use of it later in the future. Or if you have a friend, you can give it away for him. You know, those friends who just started um, fixing computer. And what I can say guys is I'm very impressed with the new RAM and its performance because the laptop is very um, what you call this um, responsive right now and before I can only play good movie 720p um, movie but let's try the 1080p because last time I checked, it was very choppy when I have my old RAM. But now, let's check it out. So, it's a natural lag. So, that's 1080p. You can see the highlight, yellow highlight. Can see my face. Let's see if there's lag. So this is the 1080p video from the movie, it doesn't lag, so it was very impressive, and 
I don't have to show it all to you because um, I might gonna have a um, copyright but this movie is good I also recommend the movie yeah. so that's all guys so thank you for watching and uh, I hope you enjoy my video and you've learned something and next I'm gonna make a video about uh, SSD because they still have a HDD hard disk drive but I'm gonna change it to solid state drive but I'm gonna find someone who knows how to um, transfer or install a windows in my new um, solid state drive so I'm gonna make a video about this next time so keep in touch and enjoy have a nice day bye bye